hell? It's surprising how many things these days are just raping our childhood. Man, is there anything that's not raping your childhood? Good point. It's interesting though, because I'm sure a lot of people who were adults when we were kids thought that their childhoods were being raped. Uh, who are you? Oh, I just thought you guys were having such an interesting conversation that I would... Well, we're not, okay? This is a boring conversation. Yes, okay then. See, it's things like that. Like, when I was a kid, I didn't even talk to anyone I knew because, sure, they were strangers, but they were also kids, and that's what we did. When you grow up, you gotta learn to be bitter and cold. You know, maybe we're just raping our own childhood. I wonder what that would feel like, you know, to rape your own childhood. I know rape is a horrible, horrible thing, but uh, if you're out there having sex already, shouldn't it be kind of fun? That's interesting, man. That's not. I see where you're going with this. Why should the evil corporations have a monopoly on it? You have to go rape your childhood. You can be gentleman about it and take it out to dinner, offer it flowers. Yeah, you know, meet his parents, uh, ask for his hand in marriage. Yeah, it'd be nice. What happened to Josh? I'm still here, dude. Oh, then, uh, who's that guy? Oh, I'm your childhood. Yeah, I, I heard you were about to rape me. So I figured, you know, instead of cowering away, I'd you know, seek out my potential aggressor. Wait, if you're his childhood, then where's my childhood? I'm right here. Oh, hey. So are you boys gonna take us out to dinner or what? Uh, okay.